You're watching 8-Bit Days a Week and today I'm gonna be trying out Resident Evil 2 on the PlayStation Classic and of course the remake of this um, is coming or is it out already? I didn't really follow um, The remake actually looks good. Oh, I think it's just a demo that came out recently. Okay, so this is the DualShock version, but I don't have the DualShock controller. But I do think it should be still playable, of course. This is the Leon disc, if anyone's wondering. A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of... This was such a huge hit for the PlayStation before. One of the biggest selling titles. And the, the idea that you have to finish uh, Leon's part before going to Claire's or vice versa actually, that would trigger some differences I believe. That was really something unheard of before. Go ahead and get to the gameplay. The CG scenes, uh, cutscenes are no problem. Oh wow, I got an infinite submachine gun, although it's kind of weak. But who cares, infinite ammo. Got hit at once. Comes with the gameplay though, having those pre rendered scenes so you don't see what's actually in front of you already. Freeze. Who are you? What are you doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human! Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. What's going on in this town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. So anyway, so far, so good. I guess I didn't, we couldn't really expect anything wrong that could happen on this uh, version port. I, 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 I'm not really sure what to call it, but anyway, just running it on the classic that is.
I don't know why I still bother with those bullets. Habit, I guess. But anyway, back to the point. Um, I guess nothing much more needs to be said. It's uh, running perfect and it's running great. I suppose you can play this while waiting for the remake to come out or you can play the demo I guess or you know I don't know refresh yourself the game with this game I wonder if uh, the version where there's uh, Elza Walker is available somewhere, anywhere? If anybody knows, please tell me, let me know in the comments. I actually want to try that out. It was the... I think it was a demo that they had which got scrapped actually, so the Elza Walker character was removed and we have Claire instead. remember I would play this on Halloween back in the day and it really does bother me sometimes like when I go to sleep uh, it has that effect I guess for a uh, teenager Sorry, but it looks like your party has been cancelled. What happened? About two months ago, there was this incident involving zombies in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other STARS members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to reveal the truth, but no one believed them. Not long after that, all this started to happen. Uh, uh, hang in there. Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take this key card. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But, just go. Fine, but I'm coming back for you. Just hold on. Man, the voice acting is really out there. Uh, 
Okay. Well, I guess nothing more needs to be said, like I mentioned earlier. Um, game is running great. This definitely has to be in your thumb drive. And um, it's, uh, it's worth replaying. It, um, it actually looks okay, given its slower resolution. Of course, it's really nothing against the remake. And um, yeah, I guess that's it for this one, Resident Evil 2 DualShock version on PlayStation Classic. You're watching 8-bit days a week. And I'll be reviewing more... Well, not really reviewing, but just gonna try out more games soon. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.